Take a perfectly good book and start changing letters, and it won't take long before it's unreadable. Information has been lost. Then how did evolution, through a similar process, morph the simplest life forms into the most complex? Evolution can create information. Many people think this is impossible, but there's several ways we know it happens. When DNA is copied or shuffled to make sperm or eggs, genes or sets of genes can be duplicated. With an extra copy no longer constrained by natural selection, the duplicate is free to take on a new role. Nearly all flowering plants and many grasses have had their entire genome duplicated at least once. Organisms can also swap or steal genetic material. This is most common in bacteria and other microbes, but a good portion of your genome is the remnants of ancient retroviruses, while nearly half can be traced to even smaller genetic invaders. These DNA parasites are actually natural selection at its smallest scale, individual units of information trying to pass on to the next generation via you. Evolution can create information. Nature's story may not have an end in mind, but it has no problem adding new pages to the book of life. Stay curious. This video is part of our 12 Days of Evolution series. Check out more by exploring Darwin's beard. Find the links down in the description, or you can click that thing that just popped up on screen. You want to add some information to your life? Check out the rest of our evolution videos.